Hey YouTube, I just uh, wanted to show you a trick here that I saw somebody do one time and uh, it's just a quick little trick, shows you how to get the uh, springs on your drum brakes on and off. Um, a, a easier way, much easier way if you don't have brake pliers. Um, using this way is a lot better than using uh, you know channel locks or vice grips. Um, so basically I watched a guy one time use a string um, looped around the spring so that he could pull on the string and lift the spring back around where the spring's got a hook into. Um, I've used string before, but sometimes the string likes to get stuck underneath this, the hook on the spring. And then it's really hard to get the string out from underneath the spring. I'm saying these words too many times. But basically what I got right here is just an old lanyard. And uh, all I'm going to do is I'm going to, I kind of got it folded in half. And I'm going to hook it underneath the end of this spring. And I'm going to come over here. And I'm going to kind of be careful not to bend, open up the hook on the spring. But you can see now that I got it hooked under there, I can really pull on this and uh, get it up to where I need to. I'm just going to pull and hook that on. And then I like to take a flat head and push, push that all the way back so that when I put my next one on, I, uh, it's kind of back out of the way. Just hook it on the end of the spring and then pull and hook it on and you're able just to pull it out the bottom because you're not pinching this underneath um, between the spring and the peg here that it's going on so um, makes doing springs on brakes so much easier um, if anyone's stuck or struggling I uh, hope this helps thanks bye